Hello, my name is Roger Madsen and I'm a senior gameplay programmer here at Bad York Games and I'm going to walk you through how to program some bots in our game. Uh, Alright, so programming. Basic programming how to set up steering for, for some cars. So the programming is a, is a node-based layout uh, where you add some input nodes and then connect them to output mode nodes and you can do some, some maths and stuff. So we'll start by adding an input node which we can then bind to our keys and we'll use this to go forward and then we'll also add one node for, for the steering which we'll do later and hook them up like that. And the next step will be to add our the power to our engines and we'll uh, add both both engines both back and front and then we'll just connect them to our input. And, and that's it. And now we can drive back and forward and back. Two nodes like this, uh, which takes up quite a bit more space, especially if you have a lot of engines, we can just group them together. And now I could control all of the engines in, in one, one node. And so for steering, I only want front steering. And to find out which engine is which, I can enable transparency mode and hover over them and see which one. So this is the front engine. So I'll drag out the steer node and then hook that up. And now we have a car that drives. And that's all that's needed to do steer for, for a vehicle. Now, if I wanted to do four wheel steering, that would be quite simple as well. Then I will just add uh, the other engine, the steer node for that. And then I have to negate the output for this. Uh, we have a special node for this. And uh, I'll have to connect it. Now this means that when this sends a positive signal, it will turn this into a negative. So this one will get positive and this negative. Uh, and we'll see that on the wheels now, going in different directions as I steer. And that's all, all that needs to do a, a four-wheel steer. Or if I just want to do back steering, I'll, I would just hook up the back motors uh, and so on. So there's really not a lot of programming needed to do simple things like this. Now, all right, so uh, another common steering scheme is, is tank steering, which is useful for when you have engines like these that don't have any, any steering at all. Uh, so basically we want to steer this bot just by the, the power of the engines, not with any steering. And in order to do this, we will need to separate the left and the right engines. Now, so on these nodes, we have a mirror mode, which we can enable. And we have it on, we get a, a blue and a, and a red input node on this, which is right and left side. So we want to want to send different inputs depending on returning to, to the left and right. But we always want the front and the back to kind of always go through. And there are multiple ways of, of doing this, but the easiest way is with one add and one subtract node to get to get this up and running. So this thing will always just be passed through like this to both right and left engine. But when we steer, we want to negate it. So we'll add one here and one here. So we have a positive value here. We're going to get a value of one here that goes through and a value of negative one here. Uh, to help with this program, we do have this debug display here. So if we enable a positive value here, we'll see that it changes here on the subtract. And on this power node, we'll see we have one at the top and one at the bottom. Which means, in our case, that we will be turning our bot. Like so. And we can go back and forward. And that's all that's needed to do a, a very basic tank steering mechanic for the game.